there has been some confusion about it because frankly there wasn't 100 percent agreement about who needed the booster and there still isn't 100 percent agreement about who needs that booster that lack of consensus could be why a recent poll from kaiser shows four in ten fully vaccinated adults are unsure about whether they are eligible to get a COVID 19 booster dose Right now, the CDC says people over 65, people over 18 who live or work in high risk places or have underlying medical conditions should get a booster based on their risk level. Dr. Threckeld says this is especially important for the older age group where immunity may decline over time. Older people are clearly going to benefit potentially from a booster. So those over 65 um, are all eligible who've had the RNA vaccine at least six months ago. If you receive the Johnson & Johnson shot, you are eligible two months after your shot. For fully vaccinated people that don't fall into the categories listed by the CDC, doctors say you should still feel confident in the protection your vaccine gives you. You are already protected against severe disease, hospitalization and death in very good percentages. So the uh, it's not an emergency to take that. I think Dr. Walensky said it well when she said, we want you to walk, not run to your booster. Encouraging those that are not vaccinated and eligible to do so. Reporting in Memphis, Janae Lewis of URG News Channel 3.